What's up guys Akshat here uh, Today we'll, I'll be showing you how to install Zex menu 1.2 on your PC I mean your Xbox 360 Okay So Well First thing I'll be doing for this video is removing my hard drive from my 360 uh, Cause you know I don't really want to delete all my stuff Okay, so this now has Zex Menu 1.1 installed. Now we'll be learning on how to install Zex Menu 1.2. Okay, guys, so the first thing you do is uh, take a USB stick, any USB stick, I'm taking a Mosaberry GB1, and put it into your PC. Uh, sorry. And put it into your Xbox 360. So now head over to settings, storage, USB storage device. Click configure now. Yes. So it should be doing it. I don't know what's taking it so long. This is too long. I don't know what's wrong. Okay. So my device is ready, but it doesn't mean performance recommendations. It's okay, I don't care. Take a now you take out this device. And plug it into your computer. Okay, so guys, now we switch over to our PCs. Okay, guys, so the first thing you gotta do is uh, download Zex Menu 1.2. Uh, I've already downloaded it. So then you open the thing. So you open the thing. Uh, extract it. This purpose I extract it to desktop. Okay. So now what you do is open up Horizon. Taking a lot of time. Yeah, so you, after you've opened up Horizon, you open up this file, or drag it in there. Now it'll show you Zex Menu 1.2, title name Zex Menu. Uh, it doesn't have any profile, device, or console ID. Title ID is called 9999, that's because that. So, you just click on save the device, flash drive. Uh, I was testing this thing before, so it's there on the flash drive already. So, I'll just override it. Let's see, yeah. So, the green thing there shows that it's writing, writing to the flash drive.
that's pretty much it for all you can do on your PC so now we switch back to our console okay guys so now you take out the pen drive from your PC and insert it into your 360 okay uh, sorry first we switch over to the 360 okay so it's see oh, sorry okay it's seen this demos it has Zex menu in there guess don't really need to copy it I mean, if you are gonna keep your USB stick in there then you don't need to copy it back there okay so I don't really have any games right now uh, but uh, okay just a minute I do have my hard disk right there don't know if you can see it I do have my hard disk this is what I'm going to connect back there oh, hold on hold on for a minute guys I don't know how to connect this thing. <sighs> there he is, child. Never mind. Okay. So here we have the games all on this thing. Okay. So uh, I won't really recommend you guys to mess up with these, this, this, these settings just changing this is like fine like uh, yeah so changing these are uh, this is like just the skin so then there's nothing wrong in doing this but I would not recommend you to mess around with the other ones okay guys so that was pretty much it for this tutorial thanks for watching bye bye